You know that feeling when your skin gets hot, your body gets tingly and your breath gets faster? Well that's me running to safety in a forest at night trying to overcome my biggest fear, being in pitch darkness alone. We're like four hours away and if something happens, we're fucked. My friend Rhodes is going to be hunting me. If he catches me, I owe him five grand at the end of the video. This is terrifying. Look at this. So I began my journey by myself at the bottom of this dark forest. Rhodes, on the other hand, began at the top, so he had a better vantage point to catch me. I think they've done something to my car and I don't know what it is. So we are here now trying to stop Brad from leaving. We're trying to catch him, but I thought I'd wrinkle in a little bit of extra spice. He's been out here hiding for ages now. Okay, pause. So because I didn't listen to my cameraman, the audio messed up while Rhodes was trying to speak. What he said was he took apart my entire car and hid these items throughout the forest. If we can stop him from leaving, we get a big fat cash prize. <laughs> He can see me so easily. I've got a fucking massive laugh. <laughs> I'm so obvious. What the fuck was that noise? I can see them as well. I can see their light. What the fuck is this? Why is there a planet fitness bag? I'm so obvious. I'm gonna have to turn my light off. Okay, I can see. This isn't it. Don't ever do this. There's no ways that they're doing this right now. If they fucking took apart the car, we're like four hours away and if something happens, we're fucked because we're in the f middle of nowhere. Why did they give me a fucking jack? Let me go back to the f car. There's a bug! <laughs> I'm being attacked by a mob. All right, bush people, let's fucking get a move on. I, I do feel a little bit worried, I but at least I'm in like a little group. Brad's completely on his own, probably out there screaming, crying. I hope this was Rhodes. Fuel and wheel is gone. <sighs> what the fuck did he do with my keys? I don't have my keys on me. That's great. I don't want to come and fucking like catch me while I'm doing this. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna jack the car up and I'm very like wary of where he could be. I'm so fucking paranoid right now. Real shit. Be nice and loud. I need to put the jack up to pressure for grips. I thought the bricks. I'm gonna leave these bricks here in case it falls. Let's go get that fucking tire. Ow. I keep hearing the fucking sounds. We are visible. He's over there, he's over there. I can't see. Yeah, they're coming, they're coming. Did you switch it off? Switch off. He saw us. Okay. Maybe I just charge at him. Oh, there he is, there he is, there he is. Yeah. Hmm. Jesus. I got attacked by a tree. What the fuck is that? What was that? What the fuck? What was that? Fuck Brad, I'm my life in jail. I'm my life in jail. You're making so much fucking noise. <laughs> Little scaredy cat doesn't want to come this direction. I think we go at him and see if he runs into the bushes. I feel like I'm seeing things. It's not Brad though, that's the, the, the scary part. This bag I'm carrying is so fucking loud and open. Look, shit. Look. This is fucking scary. I don't like this at all. That's fucking creepy. I think Rhodes put that there, but still, that's fucking creepy. The Soak's playing tricks on me. Mm. I think he's trying to give me riddles or something. This is like the main trail in front of me. I don't think you'll really see it. I think I need to get off this trail. I'm so obvious. They're so far away, though. Okay, that light there. I don't think that's in because that stayed still the while. The problem is, I need to keep this light bright so you guys can fucking see what's happening. It's also making me super, super obvious. I'm so loud. I'm hearing breaking branches, so he's got to be close. Give me the pine cone. I'm going to throw it towards him. Get a bit closer and chuck the pine cone at him. Turn it off, turn it off, turn it off. Why are they turning the light off? <laughs> that was the only thing we found in like a kilometer to actually throw at him and I wasted it. What is this light? I need to do this quickly because he's catching. What is this? Oh, <laughs> it's just a footpath. No, what is this? What the fuck is that? What did that make no, that literally makes no sense. Red. Red. 
they're coming. What the fuck? This is so sketchy. What the fuck did he put there? Is this like a fucking bottle? What the fuck is he? Deep in me. This guy fucking took fuel out of my car. Brad is right here. He doesn't know that we're here. Jesus Christ. I mean, I don't know what this is. Dude. Brad! Fuck! Freddy! Oh my god! <laughs> I don't know where we're going. Okay, ready? Hey? Brad! He's gonna turn you on. Little boy! No. <laughs> That's pretty fucking sick. I know you're here. Now that we've been fucking around, he's definitely escaped. I think. How did he get so far? Another note that doesn't make sense. Surely these arrows are on the trees. Like there was a tree with one arrow, two with an arrow going left, two with an arrow going right. And then three. Home. Yeah, I need my fucking car to get home. Also, I've doubled back behind them. Yes! Yes, look! Okay, so I need to follow those arrows. But first, I'm gonna put fucking fuel in my car so I can complete that fucking thing. Okay, he hasn't taken the jack. God. Red, it's the sweetie man. We also need to go and check if he's found any of the parts, which I need to remember where I put the parts. I'm gonna go in here. We should not go in here. He's not trying to grab one. So Brad has found one of the clues. One of our objects hasn't been found yet. The tire is still there. See, here's a perfect example for you blokes at home. Use these arrows to sort of demarcate where, in this example, we put the tire. So that's a good sign. He still hasn't found this old thing. I need to get deeper into the forest. I'm far ahead of them now. At least I'm fucking wearing all black. What are they doing? There's gotta be something there that they're looking at. I'm gonna wait for them to go. Okay, let's see what the fuck's there. This is probably the scariest thing in the whole forest. Someone has littered here, people. What are they doing? There's a litter bug on the loose. Litter bug. There's a litter bug here. They seem so far away in that space, but they're like, like 10 meters away from me. Okay. This is a weird little. I swear to God, if it's my tire, I'm actually going to get angry. I don't like that. I think we have left two clues left. left. This is not looking good, but I think he hasn't got the tire yet. It's my fucking tire. It's literally a ride. What is that? Did he seriously need this fucking knife here? Silly little boy. Let's do the sheet. What difficult thing for the fucking... Huh. This is going to take so long. Jesus, some of these fucking bushes, when they, do you mind <laughs> making all that noise? Look, this is thick. Hoppa! Now I have to fucking lug this thing back to that bloody car. Let's go. Guys, honestly, I cannot see a fucking thing. I'm getting tired and I'm getting very paranoid. Very paranoid. This guy could run out of anywhere, anywhere. Sort of down where the spade was, where I put the final clue, which is the one I don't want him to get. We definitely have to catch him there. So it's sort of at the bottom of this gorge. So I think we should pick up the pace. Turn your lights off. Fuck, they're coming. I hope I put this on your eyes, because if I don't, I'm driving. I'm not. It's not high enough up to be on. Please work. Yes. I think it's quite unfair to like camp the car. We'll find him. I'm sure he'll turn up sometime soon. My whole body's getting stuff. I'm getting tired. I don't want to get the fuck out of here. I shouldn't want to give him five grand. That is definitely your time. And I'll need to get the fucking jack down. We're gonna go check if he found his car keys. Ultimately, car keys are probably the most important. If he's found those car keys, we're done for. So then none of us get money. The keys are still here. We're still in with a chance. 
By now, he's probably found the tire, and the keys are the last thing we have left. I'm actually getting paranoid. This shit. This bush is so flippin' dense, man. No ways. Are those three arrows? What is that? Are my keys in here? How the fuck? Oh, my, my knife. I need to get my knife. Oi. Fucking locked. We've used these as sort of a combination. So our combination of arrows is gonna be one, one, and then our final combination is down there, which is a three. And then our three arrows. Brad's job is now to figure out that combination. Hopefully he doesn't get one, one, three. So there's one arrow, one arrow. Three, what if I, one. Okay, I'm gonna put in one, one, three. One, one, three. There's no ways I guess that right. Aha! Give me my fucking keys! Yeah. Give me the keys, fuck! Give me the keys! No! Jesus Christ. Get in the car! Don't get in the car, my friend! Yeah! Give me money! Ooh, ooh, ooh. You owe me five grand!